I have a knee release for you that is great if you had a knee strain, if you've had knee surgery, you haven't regained full range of motion. This area can get restricted, inflamed, and this is a great way to release it. And it is great for my patients that are doing shockwave therapy because that breaks things down and this really helps to really loosen it up after you've had something like that done because you want to keep the progress going. I am going to use a tuna ball for this and a yoga block. Um, you can use a stool, anything that gives your foot enough leverage to move because we're going to be going right below the kneecap in through here and right below onto the tibia. That's your lower leg bone. So we're taking the ball and on the outside part, that lateral side, we're going to be shifting the tissue towards that way. We're going to be moving the tibia the opposite way. So I'm shifting the ball to the outside. My tibia is turning towards the inside. So that you won't be able to see it while I'm doing it, but that is the opposing direction we're going for. Same thing for the inside, whether we're up and through here or down onto the tibia, the ball is going to be tractioning towards the inside and the tibia is going to be rotating towards the outside. So they're doing those oppositional movements. So it's very good for articulation of the knee joint as well. So I'm going to put my block up at the highest level. I'm going to take my knee, putting it on the ball, and then we're going to be squishing the tissue to the outside. So my foot starts to the outside, and as I'm pushing the ball towards this outside part, I'm going to be turning the foot in. So we're trying to get that oppositional movement. So I'm keeping the tension of the ball to the outside and I'm moving my foot to the inside, really working on that mobility because mobility does not just happen in flexion and extension of the knee joint. We have internal and external rotation of the knee as well. So now to the other way, we're tractioning the ball towards the inside. And then I'm going to take my foot to the outside. So same idea, really trying to get that tissue to move and that helps get that good tibia motion. Bruno is like, what the heck is she doing? So great mobility drill great at not just working flexion and extension because that is not the only motion that we need out of our knee. We need all the motion out of it and to keep it even. So let me know if you have any questions.